Now, influenza vaccines typically take about six months to produce, which often leads to a shortage in the case of a sudden outbreak. But that may no longer be a recurring problem as Korea has commercialized its first cell culture vaccine that's expected to shorten and simplify the manufacturing process. Park Se Young reports. During the 2009 flu pandemic, the shortage in the supply of the drug Tamiflu caused concern. Most conventional flu vaccines are cultivated in fertilized chicken eggs and take several months to produce, which can result in demand outweighing supply in the event of an outbreak. But now Korea's SK Chemicals has commercialized the nation's first cell culture influenza vaccine. The new method, which uses kidney cells from dogs to cultivate the influenza virus, cuts the production time by half. The traditional egg-based technology takes about six months. Cell culture systems reduce that time to two to three months, which allows for quicker manufacturing of more doses in the case of an influenza outbreak. According to clinical trials, the new vaccine is just as effective, if not better, than existing ones. It's also safe for those allergic to eggs or sensitive to antibiotics. The vaccine is the world's second cell culture influenza vaccine developed for adults and the first for children and people under the age of 18. The results from tests on children between the ages of 6 months and 18 years show that the vaccines are as effective or more than the existing ones. They were also proven to be safe. The new vaccine is expected to be delivered to medical institutions throughout the country this month. SK Chemicals hopes to bring about change in the domestic market that currently relies heavily on imported vaccines with plans to eventually penetrate the overseas market. Park Se-young, Arirang News.